Okay, so it's not really time for me to have another haircut because it's only been maybe a month since my last trim that I did, but I still have a lot of breakage and split ends from all the bleach that I did, so I figured I would go ahead and do one early and show you how I actually usually cut my hair by myself. So here's how my hair is looking before. Yep. And that's still from that weird hair hack thingy. And here's how I usually do it. Flip my head upside down. Brush out my hair. And yes, I know it sounds dreadful getting through those knots, but like, even if I start at the very end, it still sounds like that. That's just how effed up my hair is right now. And then, Use it to brush. Take it, stretch it all the way out, and whatever falls, I just let it go. Just let it go. I know, I'm sorry. Quality content here, you can't even see me. Make sure your arm is straight out. so you can see what the hell you're doing. Grab your handy dandy scissors. And I am not left-handed. Oh my god, these scissors suck ass. Look at that. They're brand new and what? Like, what the fuck? Let me go grab my other scissors. scissors to replace these because I thought these sucked, but proved me wrong. Alright, try this again. Handy dandy scissors. Oh, if only these are the good scissors. Oh, that's so crooked. But again, I'm holding my head crooked. <laughs> Try not to switch hands mid mid cuts. But yeah, I literally just cut straight across and do some of these. see the final result. Still so much damn hair. Honestly, I'm starting to get fed up with it. Especially since my hair is two vastly different lengths. And it's getting summertime and it's just getting in the way. Let me grab a mirror so I can check my work. Alrighty. Yeah, see, I like that a lot better than the other thing I did. That, that was so much easier and faster, and I did it on dry hair. So, that's how I usually cut my hair. 